Hey guys, uh, here we're going with episode 4 now. This one's going a lot faster than a lot of other my uh, LPs go. <laughs> because science figures tend to be that way. Who is this down here? Is this still... Oh, it's Lisbon, okay. And I think I just walk right there. Yeah. Well, that's a great start. Walk right in <laughs> to other guys and get myself killed. Eh. Just as planned. Anyway, um... Yeah, let's start chipping this musket a little bit. But I don't think I actually want this crossbow to stay here, because he could hit, get hit by the musket and by this crossbow, even though he's kind of low. Still, I don't want to risk that. There's just not much point to it. Uh, yeah, you're just going to rest up here. All the damage you took from this little excursion over here. <laughs> Stupid Iron Island. Oh, shut up, Caesar. There goes Mr. Scout. Oh, well, I stole the other one. Oh no, we got Lampa Lita. I forgot was their ally. Uh, yeah, they do have gold, so I should keep them around. What challenge do you have? Uh, requests. Oh, they want a profit. Pfft, that's not happening. <laughs> that can't happen, I don't think. <laughs> Alright, who else is that? Was that Lisbon as well I lost? Oh, I was think I was friends with them earlier. Yeah, not actual allies, I was just friends. And now they couldn't afford to keep them, so... Ooh, I lost... I did lose you guys. Florence, because, yeah, they're hostile cities, yeah, I figured as much. Um, uh, what can you build here? I'd say a bank, but your gold sucks. <laughs> so... Uh... Well, yeah, you can go ahead and build a bank, because... I'll probably end up working some kind of gold tile at some point. Yeah, I'll probably end up working that ivory eventually. So, that'll be a thing. Uh, right now, though, I'm just going to focus on getting him growing. So, if I did this, yeah, that's three more turns for two gold. That's not worth the trade off <laughs> at all. Um, and actually, yeah, you can go back to this tile now. Actually, that didn't make a difference, did it? Uh, 12 turns. Yeah, whatever. Okay, let's scoot up here. And just take this silly little cross moment out. Right now, you can go up here. And... Can we actually... Well... I don't know if I'm going to do that. I don't know if I'm going to risk moving up here and take this musket out. Eh, that works, I guess. <laughs> Any reason this crossbow's over here, buddy? <laughs> just kind of dead. Oh, not quite. Uh, maybe it will be now. We'll see. Actually, you know what? Let's get you building something else. Let's get you building your Coliseum here. Uh, sure. That works. Alright, so 10 turns on the porcelain tower. Actually, I wonder if I could... No, I don't think I can take any hills from these guys. Yeah, he has the hill anyway. Uh, should... Probably actually when these guys are done. But that... Uh, yeah, let's actually have this guy get up here and farm this... Mine that hill. And you can mine that hill. Uh... Yeah, it works, I guess. Alright, so let's get up to... Now we're going to go towards... Let's cover scientific theory for public schools. Uh, yeah, I can just kill him off. I wonder... Um, I stole it. Really? I'm 7th? Well, oh, Ramsey's really getting wrecked there. You don't want to make peace, do you? Nope, didn't think so. Good day. I wonder if... Will you declare war Proceed. on... This gives for me. Actually, it's probably a bad idea to do that because he'd probably get loot Philadelphia and just get destroyed. So, probably not a good idea to begin with. <laughs> so, I think I'm on my own here. Kind of. Mr. Lombo, you're down. 
Uh, we can poke our heads in here. Eh, not much here. Fortunately, he's slowed down a little bit because if he wants to bring units in from here, he has to bring them around uh, this horrible territory or with Philadelphia there. So, does have his own city. He can't like take a road there or something. Oh, they made peace. That didn't take that long. <laughs> Not really surprising. The AI kind of has a tendency to like make peace deals probably sooner than they should. Uh, Alright, let's grab secularism here. Alright, so we're 220 per turn. That's good. Can I actually... Uh, let's see. Uh, not really any of the specialists I want to run around here, I don't think. I could run... Let's see if I, if I run you in the capital. Yeah, the extra culture is not a bad idea. Two, 22 turns till free thought, so... Well, without the... What is it without it, though? 23, so... One less turn of the policy is not bad. Uh, yeah, I'm just trying to double check my production here to make sure I'm maximizing the turns on the uh, porcelain tower here. Because you take this tile, yeah, it's still nine turns, so... I think we have that capped out. Alright. That's fine. I'm not really worried about losing it on turn 150, so... Alright, let's get you and farm this, uh, this river tile up here for a farm. And, let me take a look around the side states against to check the quest. Uh, sure, you can blind my borders. Uh, I'm trying to decide who, if I want to sign a research group with anybody. Maybe Theo? We're a friend, right? Okay. Melima. Uh, yeah, she doesn't have really have any money, but I definitely want to do this for, before I get into the industrial era to save the 50 gold. So this is what I could do. Let me do the math in my hand. Uh, 250 minus 73. Uh, I, you can do this. You can sell your uh, lump sum for their gold per turn uh, to get them to be able to sign a research agreement with you. <laughs> And actually, wait, is she in the right era? Because if she's behind me in an era, then she's going to want an extra hundred bucks to sign it. Oh, yeah, she's still in the medieval era, though, so I might wait for her to get in there. Yeah, I'm going to... Because otherwise, it'll cost me that gold plus another hundred to sign that. And I don't want to sign with you, because you're the tech leader. Uh, what about you? You're... Kind of just a guy. You want me friends? Ah, eh, I didn't think so. Maybe we'll come back to you later when we be friends. We'll see. You're friends, but you also kind of suck, and you might get killed off kind of soon. So I'm not sure if I want to send a research agreement with you either. Um, will you be friends? Nah, that's for that. Uh, all right. Yeah. Once you, once I still take care, of, I'm definitely gonna bring that guy back. Ooh, hey, range. That's not always nice. Uh, yeah, I'll swap you guys out so we can troll this uh, musket over here with two range guys. <laughs> Just because. Should have brought the general up there first. Oh well. Um, yep, you can fortify there. Let's just keep farming these tiles up. Because when I get the fertilizer, I'll have a nice big uh, explosion of food. But for now, we're just kind of standing pat until uh, Porcelain Tower, at least. And I'm really not sure if I want to plant that scientist or not. I'm going to get from the Porcelain Tower. What else do I have? I have... All right, one coming here. Which is good. Ah! Oh. Police America. Oh, hey! Oh, nice, another longbow one. I was afraid I'd get something garbage here, but yay! Uh, hey, Theo. You're being plotted against by the guy with the worst army on the planet. <laughs> FYI. <laughs> uh, yeah, let's just grab steel here and then get out. Let's go back to the capital so we can steal uh, Sweden's spy, or kill Sweden's spy there, hopefully. Yep, yeah, you can get going on a uh, farm there. 
Alright, that's much better. There we go. Uh, let's actually let's bring you up one tile. Okay, yeah. Well, you can take that guy in at least. Don't mind me watching John. I'm just killing guys inside your borders. We're just having a little war. <laughs> uh, okay, you guys are friends. That's nice. Yeah, I got your friends. Shut up. I don't care. Annoying as Caesar telling me I'm my army sucks. Okay, count almost nine pop. No, go away, Sweden. Oh, yeah, he caught me anyway. I figured he would. If he didn't catch it the first time, then I figured he'd catch me the second time. It's about the limit, usually. <laughs> Although I have had times where I was still on from guys three or four or five times, and they just don't notice it. <laughs> how you don't notice that, I don't know, or how you don't get caught. I didn't get caught, but hey, I'm not going to complain. Alright, uh, he's not quite down, but I'm not too concerned. So, uh, and yeah, let's chip at you, because yeah, even if he comes in there, he's not going to do that much. Are these mines going? Eh, you have two and two, so. Let's bring you up here so you can chip at that guy. And we'll bring you back just so Washington doesn't, like, start to complain about my troops on his borders or blah. Which he'll probably do if I leave him there, so. Isn't it great how the AI can do that? And, like, say, if he walks a giant army around my border for 50 turns, I can't. This is why I probably shouldn't feel as bad as I do sometimes about using the AI <laughs> when they can cheat like that. Yeah, see, that musket man just came in there and just did whatever. And now they're both going to get killed. Uh, although I would honestly not be surprised to see Caroline start to crop up uh, relatively soon. In fact, he may have them already, I just don't know it. Because AIs, the major AIs just don't upgrade their units particularly well. I don't know why, they just don't. <laughs> like, if you've ever, ever been hoarded by, like, a wave of, like, muskets in, like, turn 100, that was probably units they just cranked out. <laughs> they probably didn't uh, even bother upgrading those, because that's what the AI does. Um, yeah, I guess we'll get, uh, what do we want to build here? Um, that's a good question, actually. I guess maybe we should get that temple. Well, see, I talked about the temple, but I'm just not going to have really any faith, even if I do build those, to get a great person going, because there's just no religious city-states on this map or anything, because... Let's say if I got... Even if I got my faith up here, it's 2, 4, 6, that's 8 per turn, out of, like, the 1,000 I need. And uh, that's 125. Yeah, that's not, that's not happening. So, blah. Oh, well. Yeah, let's grab a theater then instead. Um... Here, uh, yeah, your gold kind of sucks too, but oh well. Not much you can do about that. I at least do want to get another crossbow here. Maybe get actually, that's what I should do. I should get a cannon go or a trebuchet on here because if I'm actually going to go and hack somebody with some uh, or pre build it anyway. I'll get it to like one, and then when I get done in chemistry, I'll start building it so it'll push the stuff into the hammers into a a cannon, and so forth. And then do it into an artillery. <laughs> or upgrade into an artillery when I hit dynamite. Again, if I go that route, I don't know what I want to do yet. Alright, there's economics. There's another scientist. And, yeah, I think this will be the last planted scientist. I think I'll just save the uh, portion tower window bulb later on. I don't know what the exact mathematics are, or are for when you should start when you should save, when you should bulb, etc. But... Yeah, see, this is what I mean. You see this stupid spearman here who has no business being around? <laughs> and yet he, he is because the AI doesn't upgrade their units properly. Uh. Oh, hey, now Theo's in the Renaissance. Let's go sign a research agreement with you. Because even though your beakers kind of suck, I can still get the portion tower bonus and maybe, uh, what you call it? The uh, other bonus. So, alright, hang on. I need 250. Shut up, Theo. <laughs> Try to think here. Uh, so, yeah, 250 minus 13. I'm trying to figure out what that is in gold per turn. How much gold per turn she's going to want for that, probably. Or will give me, probably. Because she gives 22 for one. Um, will you give me. Let's see. Will you give me. 
Uh, yeah, eight like says. eight or seven might be it. Or yeah, it should be seven. Will you give me eight. I know she won't give me eight, but uh, <laughs> it's a net loss of twelve, and that's a net loss of like thirty-seven or twenty-seven. So yeah, let's just do this. Let's do eight. <laughs> and research agreement. There we go. So yeah, I don't know if I'll get down to the scientific revolution before that pops. I, I doubt it, but still. I took some decent beakers because of the extra 50% uh, porcelain tower, and I should have some pretty ridiculous gen beaker generation. Or, yeah, my own. Uh, well, really? Good job, Mr. Counter Spy. <laughs> Your your only purpose is to not let him steal from me, and you let him steal from me. Blah. Uh, yeah. What about you? Uh, yeah, you just get back and heal a little bit. So yeah, we have a nice army of crossbowmen here that we could probably use to go kill somebody, but it's almost turn one fifty. I get the feeling we're gonna start seeing rifles relatively soon. That's just kind of ugly when you get rifles against, uh, what you call it, against crossbows. Uh, especially since I know he has Minutemen. I saw his Minutemen a good, like, 20, 30 turns ago. So I'm sure he's not that far off of rifling. He's, someone's going to hit the industrial pretty soon. I'm surprised none of them... Well, I'm not that surprised, because like I said before, they're all busy kind of killing each other. Or, this is kind of a weird map, so they haven't really had that much room to expand around all over the place. Like, Hoathic has, and by expand I mean he's beat up the Inca <laughs> a little bit, but everyone's kind of clustered together. Like, Theo's kind of just stuck here, and yeah, this is just a mess. Like, this right here is just, ugh. And I'm stuck off in the corner here, I have no room to go anywhere. Alright, you're gonna go right here and plant. And like I said, I think that's gonna be it for our planning scientists. Especially once we get the scientific theory. Uh, oh wow, it's Hawatha declaring. Oh, it's Sweden. Okay, wow. I didn't think he'd do that because he's kind of out of the way, and Sweden still has the Great Wall. <laughs> That's just kind of going to be annoying for him to fight, but okay. If it keeps him distracted, then fine by me. <laughs> eh, Ragusa. Okay, whatever. Or Ragasu, if you prefer. <laughs> Uh, what about you, Todd? Yeah, your goal kind of sucks, is the thing. Uh, what happens if you do this? Uh, one more turn for four gold. Okay, that, that's a good trade, I think. And, yeah, you can go and get your bank going, I think. Uh, how are you doing here? Uh, still three, right, three turns till next pop. That's not bad. So two turns, yep, yeah, there's your minimum. Yeah, you went out and upgraded it. Uh, let's go ahead and just build a fort here, because I'm not really going to use this tile that much. So I'll just probably put a unit in there, like a, uh, a musket eventually or something, just to have the extra defense bonus for when it comes over there. Uh, at some point I may remove it for, the, for a uh, farm, especially once you get to fertilizer, but for the moment it's probably better just to have him there to uh, defend that way. In case Washington just decides to try to be cute and do something. And yeah, let's move these guys around here because the range is being kind of dumb. Being really dumb. This is why I don't play England that much. <laughs> because I hate being, hey, you can shoot three, you can shoot from three tiles away. Asterisk, not always. But, oh well. What are you going to do? And let's, yeah, let's go ahead and farm this up here, I guess. I want you to do with that tile. Yeah, I would like to kill Caesar, but he's kind of out of the way. Sorry. <laughs> Sorry, lady. I can't make it peace with any of these city-states yet. All right, I can make peace with you. And not you, not you, so. All right. Hey, so no one just dies, okay? So many dies. Let's see. Uh, well, they have dies, but they just don't have a lot of them. Because trying to trade from the only copy of an AI's luxury just doesn't work. The AI's not going to give it to you for anything remotely reasonable, so. Um. Yeah, he's 
pulling back here, I guess, which is a thing. I think he might be dead. Yeah, I think Washington here might actually kind of be wanting to Dow uh, Sweden. I don't know. What if he'd be up for that? I trust you are a friend to liberty. Uh, actually, I think Proceed. since I'm at war, I think he's not going to want to do this. Uh, I think so. I probably can't make this work any. Proceed. How uh, many you got that much gold, dude? You got the crap beat out no. of you. <laughs> oh, whatever. Maybe I'll get lucky and he'll down me with, like, trebuchets and crap, and I'll just blow him out of the water and get a good piece deal or something. <laughs> uh, oh, hey, Mr. Crossbowman. Well, the good news is it's not stuck in the same music track as last time. The bad news is it's still getting stuck on a music track. <laughs> oh, well. I dealt with bigger problems <laughs> than the music track being annoying. Oh, well. Shut up. God, you, you know what? You're not actually doing well here either, buddy. You're kind of... For being Mr. Rome, you got like what? You got like three cities? Please. And you're about to get the living shit beat out of you. Oh, okay, we have like seven cities, whatever. <laughs> wow, you declared born Pachuti. Nice, Pachuti. Eh, that's probably gonna get you killed down the road, because someone's gonna come in and just flank you. Like, America might do it. Alrighty, there's Porcelain Tower. Woo. So that's one sign, just to sit there. And let's get a garden going. ASAP. And let's see, what was that? Oh, the Eric Walker place someone for Jakarta. And let's just chip at you a little bit to keep you in place. You make him fortify to heal. Ah, but you. Alright. We'll drag you around there. That works. Uh, I think this guy's gonna get away, unfortunately. Oh well. And the happiness is still not really an issue right now. I'm hoping to get a... Uh... Oh, the early bot side on up. Uh, I'll get my circus up in the capital and all that stuff relatively soon. We're gonna food focus. Oh, wow, there you go. I wonder if he would declare war on Sweden. <laughs> and you still have swordsmen. Are you effing kidding me? You have like 2,000 bucks. I know you have Minutemen because I've seen them. And you're gonna come here and with swordsmen. Are you joking? They really need to fix that. It's been a problem since vanilla. The AI just doesn't put priority on upgrading their units, whereas the city-states will always do it. City-states will just have, like, yeah, you see, like, muskets, cannons, knights, pikes. Well, the pikes, well, yeah, no one's at Metal Archie yet, so, yeah, what are they gonna do about it? It's just kind of done. Yeah, see, they have crossbows. Uh, you want why, actually? I wonder if I can get you on my side. I don't really care that much because they have gem, which I can have like two copies of. But if I get someone's wine, I could do that, but no one really has the resources. Yeah, like Theo is going to want like an arm and a leg for it. Melima. Yeah. <laughs> That's not happening, Theo. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> uh, and Pachikis are going to be the same way, I think. Oh, yeah, there's no way to make this work even. Oh, there I go. Uh. And I'm sure you're the same way. Yep. Let's see if we make this work. What about you? Uh, uh, yeah, you don't have Y anyway, so whatever. Alright, well, uh, we might buy my boss up a different way, but I'm not too... I am a little concerned that he might buy them up here, but still, I can hold them off since I get 30 the strength sitting right here. I can always buy walls if I need to. I'm not too concerned about some pipe and some crossbows. Uh, I do need to get out of here, though, I think. Yeah, I can't stand there next to Seattle. Or, they'll get me shot up by Seattle if I stay there, rather. So, let's give you rough terrain here. Um, yeah, wow, I kind of can't believe he came in here with this garbage. Like, the pikes, okay, I can see that. I mean, he doesn't have metallurgy. He can't do anything about that, but... Swordsman, yeah, when I've seen you with gunpowder units and you're sending iron units in here, you, there's no real excuse there. He's just being bad. And, yeah, let's... All right, you're open. So, uh... Let's kill this guy. We're making chip him up. Settle there. Or 
supported by the heal there, so. And, alright, that works. Let's bring Mr. Crossman over here, just in case. This is actually really good that I have the Citadel here now, too, because if the shots come around this way, they'll just get kind of shredded. <laughs> so. I wonder if I can get... I know the Romans hit my gods, Please. but... For reasons that are kind of dumb. Yum. Well, okay, some of them I can kind of see. Yum. Uh, white covers my lands from all the way over there, but... Yeah, I know how to make this work. Ha! Suck it. Uh, I'll forgive him, just because... Even if I tell him, don't spy on me, he's gonna keep spying on me, so... Whatever. <laughs> Might as well maybe get like a one so he'll maybe be a little less of a douche later on. Yep, there's your Minuteman. And there's your other Minuteman. And unfortunately I didn't have time to finish that fort before he came in here. So and even if I had, it probably would have been a bad idea to leave them there getting sandwiched, but okay. I'll leave that settler there, whatever. Uh on to my next general comes. And eh, it's a ways, so. Uh this musket. Uh, we'll just kill him off, I think. Yeah, because that's a river there. They're cut off. So, he'll be okay. Uh, you shouldn't really stay there, I don't think. Suppose since you have range, and we have any reason to be that close. <laughs> the longbowman can stay there, I think. Uh, I'd like to get the pike in there, actually, if I can, but that's going to take a couple turns. I don't even feel like moving in there to capture that guy because it's just going to take forever. <laughs> he'll get in there and he'll get shot up by a bunch of stuff, so whatever. Alright, let's bring you back here. And, yeah, you'll just... Actually, yeah, you're not, he's really going to come hit you this turn, so you can shoot that composite bowman. Why do you have composite bowman? I thought I just forgave him already, but okay. <laughs> did, I, did I not just go up to him and say, hey, I forget, I'll let you slide this time. Ooh, yeah, here we go. There's the muskets. I figured they were coming kind of soon. Woo, yeah. industrial era. I got a spy. Let's see. Ooh. Yeah, let's actually give you logistics, because I want to have a logistics guy to, like, defend a little bit. They're much better for defense than offense. And I can get, he'll get ranged faster if he's playing defense and shooting guys up. Uh, okay, let's... Mm, yeah, it's not even a waste of turn on that. That's just a waste to shoot that guy when he's got the, uh, the general, or the <laughs> rough train bonus, because he's a Minuteman. Alright, Mr. Pike, how are you coming along here? Uh, is that a road? That's a road, okay. Yeah, this is a little difficult here with Seattle right here, and that trebuchet to shoot people up. Um... Let's take this spy over here. Let's take them to... Let's put you in Mombasa. Gonna make pick Mombasa up as a buddy. Those are my next policy coming in seven turns, so 160 I'll have a uh, free thought. Right, yeah, let's get your... Uh, what you call it here? Let's get your production focus for the moment to get this going faster. Uh, yeah, it's just gonna starve you anyway, so it doesn't make a difference. What about you? Ooh. Yeah, you're gonna take forever. Uh, well, 20 turns. 18, well, that's still going to starve you, though, so... 21, oh, yeah. <laughs> okay. Um... Yeah, I want to do with him. See, that's kind of what I would have liked to build the ironworks there, but at the same time, my capital needed it, too. So it was kind of a hard decision to make. Let's actually get National Treasury going here real quick, I think, just so I can have the gold. And that, then we'll get a public school going. Alright, so this is kind of a mess. Let's pull you back. You're gonna get pulled back. Um... Yeah, I think everyone kind of just needs to do a retreat here. <laughs> Except this guy. This guy can stay here. Well, no, he can't, because he's a range. He should move up. So you can go there. And you can go there. And we could... Didn't quite kill that musket, okay. Whatever. Um... Yeah, you guys are both going to make full retreats. He could shoot one and, and move, but he'd just get 
Uh, double musket snacked wherever you want to. Let's move you here so you don't, uh, risk you getting, like, some bullshit killed by some, like, horse unit flying in and killing the, uh, <laughs> killing him and killing my general off. That would not be good. And you can come and just farm that up. Yeah, what you're gonna do, you're just kind of there. Oh, ooh, yeah, you can cut that musket off. Very good. Oh, right, I forgot to cancel your trebuchet. Crap, whatever. Oh, well, you can stay there. You're kind of useless, but okay. Yeah, you can just sit in the sitting of the oligarchy bonus if something comes out that way. Yeah, I'm kind of busy here. <laughs> but thanks. If I ever need to get in a war that I shouldn't be in, I'll let you know. Yeah, you know my stuff. I don't think so. Yeah, see, this is what I mean about, yeah, 32 damage. They take almost the same amount of damage, and he's not even fortified. He's just a guy. He's just there. Uh, let's at least get you out of here, because I can put this pike in here now. That would be the better option, I think, because he's got cover and everything, so. Oh, uh, where's my logistics guy? There's my logistics guy. Uh, you have range, so... Oh, whoops, you moved already, though. Derp. That uh, was kind of a waste. Uh, wow, it was not played very well by me. <laughs> okay. Oh, no, I'm being attacked by a worker. And you're just gonna... This guy will just stay there. So, yeah, this pike's probably gonna get beat up pretty badly. But I'm not too concerned. <laughs> so, yeah. Let's, yeah, we'll smack that knight there. I don't know if there's a unit up here. My, because I'd like to move this guy here, but my bet is that there's a unit of some kind there. Um. And if there's not, there might be one there. Like a bowman or something. So, yeah, I'll just leave you here. Uh, yeah, you can just wait there. Good thing is, if I'm saving some money, so if I get to industrialization, I can upgrade a couple of these uh, longbows to be, uh, what you call it, the uh, ranged Gatling guns and just trash everything. Uh, did I lose a friendship? No. Okay. Uh, Ragusa is okay. Flood is okay. Uh, oh, Florence is going down. Oh, and Zurich is too. Hmm. Zurich I'm less concerned about because I still have a circus and all that stuff I can build if I need uh, some happiness. I'll still get some happiness from being friends with them. And Florence is going to be fine. They're in a little bit of trouble, but, you know, it's a 42 defense city. They have a good number of their own units, including, you know, some muskets and trebuchets and a crossbow and stuff. So, and if need be, I can send some units down there in a bit and help them out. Let's throw this guy over the, over here while I'm at it. Because you can't, it's no point having all these units over here trying to shoot in the same place when they can't fit. <laughs> so, actually, I think I'll just leave this guy here. I have no idea how long this video has been running because apparently I accidentally closed out my timer, so. Or maybe I didn't. Okay, I have six minutes left, okay. Oh, close to my phone. Oh, yeah, see, he's fine. 30, 30, uh, yeah, 28, 16, ooh. There is the, uh, yeah, that's the, uh, what you call it? The, uh, Swedish Lancer replacement, which I actually didn't show off in my LP because Lancers are kind of ass, but that's another story. <laughs> As I, I, I've had that rant already, I'm not going to do it again, but <laughs> let's see about you. Eh, let's give you range, or give you that. Accuracy 3. Uh, if we can just kill this guy off in one go. Well, what wave anyway. That works. Yeah, Lancers vs. Crossbowmen Actually, does kind of hurt a little bit. I kill that musket off. There we go. Minimum, whatever. So yeah, cover two. Sh uh, shock guy out here, fortified. In the, you know what you call it. Not concerned about that getting broken. <laughs> That's the power of citadel. People ask, how do you deal with spam? It's like drop a citadel. He just wrecked a musket that came at him. <laughs> like not even close. Just like did the double the damage. Oh, wow, you're going to go down him then, okay. 
Let's say they throw you in food. Oh, hey, yeah, my food's getting better now. I've got to build things, so. Yeah, let's go to the capital. Might as well go for it. Really? Blah. So they are sending their uh, units in here. They're uh, operating. They're definitely going up into that because he's got. Man, they have muskets and, yep, now crossbows. And I saw lanterns, so he's come down this way to uh, metallurgy down here. Would not be surprised if he goes to rifling because that's just a. You know, a couple turns from that. Uh, yeah, number three in tech right now. Who's number two, I wonder, then? Ramses, maybe? I don't know. Oh, well. Once we get the public schools up and stuff, we'll be fine. And I might... I kind of want to cave and buy this here, but it's just so expensive. I can't afford to buy that. Uh... What if I can sell this to anybody? That's the other thing. I lost a training partner for something like Ivory. I didn't have that many luxuries to begin with to sell. Uh, yeah, no one wants my stuff. So, uh, yeah, this guy can be to mind that. But I think since I got enough improvements, really, uh, actually, go get that. I think I'll just go ahead and just get rid of one of these workers, save a little gold return there. Because God knows I'll probably end up capturing one at some point anyway from a <laughs> one of these guys. They'll do something dumb and leave one out in the open. Oh, yep, see, range bug. I can hit this guy, but I can't hit this guy, so. Ugh. Eh, what about you? Uh. Oh, yep, you go with that. Kill that guy off. Yeah, I don't want to move this guy in here because I'll get shot up by this. Although this crossbowman's still in trouble. Hmm. Should have moved him. Because he doesn't get shot by this crossbowman. This musket's gonna come smack him, and this crossbowman's gonna move up probably and shoot him. So, eh. I could just throw the trebuchet in there as fodder, but I think I'll just take my chances. There's no guarantee that he actually kill him either. So, boy, he's gonna wait it out. Oh, it's cross your fingers. Oh, Theo doubted Augustus too. Wow. For the vulture, I guess, even though he's like worth the points, whatever. Oh wow! <laughs> Swinging down in two. Wow. Okay. <laughs> oh no, he's flanking me. Uh, how long until my next general so I can drop another citadel? Possibly. Ah, it's gonna waste to go. Whoops! Went flying over the place there. <laughs> All right. Yeah, let's grab the public school here real quick. Uh, let's get you over there. I'm getting flanked but by a bunch of garbage, so I'm not really concerned. At least he figured out, hey, the Citadel's not getting me anywhere. Let's go around it. I, uh, I gotta give the AI credit where it's due. Alright, logistics guy. He's dead. Anything in here, really? Oh, I can't go check. Yeah, Pax was dead. <laughs> Thanks for coming out. And let's just kill... let's go rough or open there. Uh, let's go rough here, just to mix it up. You can come around this way. What was that? So what a Ramses. Okay. And, yeah, you'll have fortified heal. Actually, let's... you can shoot him for some experience. Shoot the stupid worker. <laughs> Alright, I really hope I have coal. Because uh, I don't have coal, I'm be a very sad person. <laughs> oh, I'm not. How did they get off that academy? What the hell? Oh, no, that one's. Be oh, there was a guy on it. What you call it? Blockading it. Durr. I killed him. That's why my science just got down a little bit because the. Uh, I had. Uh, two academies blockaded. Wow. <laughs> Caesar is just getting dropped here. <laughs> God damn. Okay, just as I say, he figured out the Citadel to go around it, he comes up here and gets like three knights smacked. Trying to attack a fortified pikeman. Just... Okay. I, I have to see this though. Is this. <laughs> oh, that's great. <laughs> at war with Byzantium, at war with the Iroquois, at war with the Inca, at war with Sweden, at war with America. And I know Egypt's plotting against them, so I could actually end up being six Daos. 
Oh, that's that's pretty amazing. <laughs> I think I'm going to leave it on that note. So I'll see you guys in episode 5. Wow. Yeah, just imagine, just remember, if you ever think you're getting kind of dog piled with the AI, it could always be worse. You, you, you could be the Romans right here. <laughs> see you guys.